Okay, here we're going to evaluate some factorials. Uh, just to get a feel for factorials, since you have to use factorials when you calculate permutations and combinations. Well, 5 factorial, that's just shorthand for 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. So, let's see. 5 times 4 is going to be 20. 3 times 2 is going to be 6. So if we multiply 20 times 6, we get 120. So 5 factorial is equal to 120. Um, factorials get very large very quick. You know, 5 factorial is already bounced up to 120. Suppose we want to do 4 times 5 factorial. Well, you need to do the factorial first, or you know, it definitely doesn't hurt to write it all the way out. So this is 4 times again, well, 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. Well, we've already seen that 5 factorial is 120. So 4 times 120, if we simplify that, we get 480. So 4 times 5 factorial is 480. Uh, do not multiply, you know, something uh, that, that might be tempting to do that, that's definitely not correct. Don't say it's 20 factorial, you know, don't somehow multiply the 4 and the 5. 20 factorial is going to be a huge, big number, definitely not going to be 480. So do not do it that way. If you're not sure whether or not you can sort of do a process, just write it out, and then you'll sort of see everything, you know, written out, and you can just multiply. Okay, so let's see. Um, in part C, we've got 6 factorial. So that's 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 minus. We've got 7 minus 3 factorial, so I'm going to uh, simplify. 7 minus 3 is 4 factorial over 3 factorial. Well, let's see, we can always uh, simplify this. We've seen that 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, that's equal to 120. So if we take 6 times 120, uh, 6 times 120 is going to be 720. So again, if you multiply those all out, you'll get 720. You could calculate 4 factorial, calculate 3 factorial, and then, uh, you know, simplify it. Uh, notice though, 4 factorial is 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. 3 factorial is just 3 times 2 times 1. So if we cancel out those common factors, really we're just going to be left with a 4 in the numerator. So we have 720 minus 4. If we simplify that, we get 7, uh, 716. 